it. So here I am in Umakao, which is about 30 minutes away to Caguas, I believe it is, where JD Paintball is at. I could be wrong, mistaken. For those of you who I met at JD Paintball, please go ahead and hit the comments and I'll go ahead and share it in the second part of the video, which I'm going to try to split up in this video between two days on our drive to uh, Caraguas from uh, Umacao. So right now we're driving from Umacao. Yeah, I don't know if paintball is going to be available. It's raining. Who knows? I'm going to check out the field anyways. Yeah, so we're that driving. dry. Yeah. Look at that. It's not even raining. That's wild. Off and on showers too. <laughs> island fever thing going on here. That's kind of how it is throughout the whole day. <laughs> we didn't really know what it was going to rain, stay dry. It ended up showing up anyways, and luckily it was open. So a lot of the paintball, I guess, unspoken rules apply here. Rain or shine, um, the fields are open. Here we are. We're getting really close to the park. And this is, yeah, we're getting really close to the park. This is, a, I guess, a, a little landmark to help you navigate with some uh, some statues here, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah African statues, African people statues. Here we are. We're about literally three minutes away from this landmark to the park. And then there's the park. Really There's nice, very out in the open. You can actually see the netting, the right. so you know you're there, yeah, it is which is here. great. Yep. And then, uh, yeah, the first day, thankfully, I uh, <laughs> had the opportunity. Park. Had the opportunity to go ahead and shoot my gun to make sure everything was running right. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, it's pretty fun. Thank goodness I brought my shoes. Yeah, you can park here. Or go down the street. Yeah. Yeah. First and then come back. Just uh just find a parking. Yeah, it looks like they repainted that shipping container. Because it's a lot different than when I saw it online. I think it was red when I saw it online. It like and then see see how it's red and recording? Uh -huh. It's recording. If I want to stop the video, I'm gonna press the top button again. Okay. So yeah. And it's waterproof too, it could get wet. Okay. So yeah. All right, guys, here I am, Puerto Rico. Trying to get this airball field in right now. It's raining, as you can see. Um, here are the prices at J JD's Paintball. Bound to change, maybe in the near future, who knows? But yeah, got my gear packed up. And we're gonna walk towards the field right now. And here it is, yo. Straight from Cali, dude, it's raining. But they got the airfield here ready to go. Let's go. It's about an hour, an hour and a half from the airport. But uh, JD's paintball, it's pretty neat. Hopefully I can get some points in guys. All right, here we go. No one's out here, so I'm just gonna chrono with a gun. Out here in Puerto Rico. My dad's getting, you know, whoop, gonna chrono with a gun. Right over here in the airfield. I have my pads in the car in the event people want to play, but we'll see. And where you started? Huh? Yeah. It doesn't matter, I'm going to be here on the, on the barrier. How do you turn it on? It's on already. So here's the layout. I can't recall what layout this is. I don't know. It's the NXL Wind City 2023 layout. Um, but yeah, I also feel like out here is a smaller field opposed to where, when I play. But I don't know. It's just here having a good time and just testing out the, the waters out here. Right again, it's 2023. Parks, you know, pretty neat. Um, I was only really focused on the airfield. I don't know what other um, 
layouts they have at that particular ball, um, paintball park. I might not know. I should actually went more exploring a little bit more, but I was just really trying to get more information about the field. Um, Spanish really only um, can get away with the English. But um, yeah, see you guys tomorrow in the next part of the clip here. Be tomorrow. Have a good one. See you tomorrow in the clip. All right. Oh, cool. I can see myself in the reflection. Oh. We're here at JD Fields, repping City of the Trees right here. Going out for some points. Bought two bags. Let's go. Look at that clear paint though. Green fill with clear paint. <laughs> As you can see, everyone here is literally speaking Spanish. So um, my Spanish wasn't all that good. Now I know I need to go ahead and work on it. And again, this is Puerto Rico, JD uh, Paintball. Field. Se lo dieron, se lo dio a Alex. Se lo dieron a la pistola, 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 a la p
una vez. No, pero le vaciaron, le vaciaron. Pero yo no le estoy pasando lo que le pasó. Eso lo dije yo, ¿eh? No, yo sé, no, ni la íbamos a hacer, pues yo se la iba en el estándar. Y el muchacho. Sí, 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 Son públicas, pero vienen los hoteles y eso y se meten para adentro, you ¿no? Know? Sí, realmente hay una problemática actual. Sí. Que tristemente, pues, nos están privando de nuestros recursos. O sea que sí. hay muchas playas y muchas cosas, pero, ¿sabes? No se puede excluir a la gente de aquí, porque tristemente, en dos o tres años, si seguimos como vamos, Vamos a terminar como, lo, como California, que la gente está viviendo en la calle Ajá. porque tiene dinero. Hawái, Hawái. Los, que los gente... nativos no pueden vivir ahí mismo. Ah, esa va a ser la situación de nosotros. No, eso es triste. Es súper triste. ¿Sabes qué es lo que pasa? Que la gente no lo entiende. Wow. Y eso viene y la cosa es que es como se expande y de la noche a la mañana, boom, aquí sí. estamos. Como un tipo ya en el, en el oeste vino de Boston, compró un bildicito. Y ahí, de repente, boom, todo el mundo para afuera, lo voy a hacer el hotel, Airbnb. Y, y no está mal que te hagas con tu dinero lo que te dé la gana, pero no así. No así, porque va a afectar tanta familia. No, ¿no? no debe si ser. Quitar esto. ¿Eh? Si tiene la, la, la herramienta para quitar esto, necesito flyers. Es que vamos a volar y no puede llevar eso ah, en el avión. Sí, voy a ver si alguien aquí tiene. Ahí. Yo tengo la otra parte, pero necesito vice grip. Ah. No, no. No, just leave it. You're the condo. Solo necesita la la llavecita. Sí, no la llavecita, pero um, un tercer tercer elevador. Una base, una base que aguante, que lo aguante en lo que.